Hi, my name is Joby, and welcome back to Kids Corner. Um, I was um making some ornaments to put on our Christmas tree, and um, they're really pretty. Um, because that's what you put on a Christmas tree, you know. So um, it's almost Christmas time, which is very exciting. And something exciting about Christmas time is that. It's the season of Advent. So, um, today we're gonna start doing our Advent. We're not gonna do a little intro to Advent for a video. We're just gonna do, we're gonna go straight into Advent. And um, today, I wanna let you guess what we're doing. What Advent we're doing today. If you were right, you must have said hoped. Hope. So it's hope today that we're going to do for Advent. Um, so do you see this tree right here? here? Let me pick it up so you get a better view. Um, see how it's bare? There's no like, not bare like the animal, but like bare spelled B-A-R-E. Um, it doesn't have any ornaments on it. It just looks like a plain old tree. As you can see, this is the Charlie Brown tree. Um, but soon, we do have these little ornaments. Soon, it's going to be decorative and nice and pretty because it has all the little ornaments on it. So, let's start reading this scripture. Or no, not scripture. Um, little book thingy. So, let's start reading this. When God spoke, the universe began. Stars and planets remind us that Jesus gives light. Creation brings glory to him. It's kind of short, but it means a lot, even if it's short. So, now let's place this ornament on this tree to represent hope. Let's put it right here. There we go. Um, so now we're going to read a scripture with, um, New Testament and Old Testament in it, which is kind of exciting. Not really anything big, but just, I wanted to share it with you guys. So let's read Genesis 1 through 1. This is kind of short, just to remind you. In the beginning, God created the heavens and the earth, but it still means a lot. Okay, now we're gonna do. Oops, is where did it go? I don't care. I see it right here. Okay, so this one, this one is um, John one one through three. Okay. In the beginning was the Word, and the Word was with God, and the Word was God. He was in the beginning with God. All things were made through him, and without him was not anything made that was made. There was not anything made that was made. There we go. So, yeah, those were the two scriptures that we did. Um, and before I get on to my uh, back to here and praying, um, I don't want to make this too short or too long, so let's talk a little bit. I kinda wanna talk about the scriptures today. I just kinda had that feeling that I wanna talk about them. So even though Genesis is short, um, it still can mean a lot because um, whenever it says God created the heavens and the earth, this is basically most of the whole thing. Um, if without God, think about this, without God, we wouldn't be anything. It would just be a plain whole earth and there would be no... No earth. There wouldn't be an earth. Yeah, and there wouldn't be no meaning to life. So, yeah, that's the first one. And now we're going to do um, this one. Whenever it says... This part's a little long, but whenever it says, In the beginning was the Word, and the Word was, was with God, and the Word was God. The Word is God. That's, that's all I have to say for that one. The word is God. 
Right. And sometimes people call the Bible the word. Yeah. Because, and that's God speaking yeah. to us. Right? Yeah. yeah. So now let's um, pray before we get back to these ornaments. Okay. Dear Heavenly Father, thank you for letting Christmas time be a thing so we could celebrate Advent and Christmas time. Uh, thank you for um, building the earth for us because you're, you are the word and without earth there wouldn't be a meaning to life or, and there would be no earth. So thank you. In your name we pray. Amen. Bye.